morning. It's nine o'clock. Maytag finally got my butt up and packed up. It's been raining and windy and freezing and uh, I wouldn't get out and I had a headache. So um, there's still people camped. Um, some left already, looks like. But um, yeah, it's gonna be a rainy day today. Whew. We have to go up higher, up to over 6,000 feet. That's why I didn't want to go up there. The wind was howling. So I gotta help Maytag put the tent away.
right, uh, 1.8 miles. <coughs> We're at Roan Mountain Shelter, and this shelter is totally enclosed with a door. It's so high up in elevation, low ceilings, and then there's a loft area up there that's much bigger. I guess there were eight people down, eight people down here last night, and a whole slew of people up upstairs. <sighs> Only two people were left when we got here this morning. I'm sure they were freezing and uh, got out of Dodge real fast. Look at this. Someone with a sense of humor. But look, it lights up. Yeah, so we have... Uh, at least eight more miles to hike today. Back out into the freezing cold. Oh, the door's wide open. Right, this is a shelter. It's kind of cool. If it wasn't so cold, I'd back up so you could see it, but um, there's a lot of sensitive areas roped off, you could see. And, uh, We've got some icy, uh, icy conditions. We got to go down back to trail. We had to take to get up here. So we just heard. We just got back on the trail. We just heard that there's trail magic in two miles. <laughs> That's awesome. I hope it's like warm, like soup or chili or something. <sighs> that must be a Carver's Gap or whatever it is coming up. But we can't go too fast because it's icy. So I got to put this away. <sighs> That's exciting. Christmas trees. I wish I had smell -o vision so you could smell. Oh, it smells so nice. <laughs> it's really pretty up here. I wish it was a little warmer. <laughs> Normally I'd be cursing these rocks out. But they're actually helping with the ice and the slush. Uh, it's beautiful up here. Uh, I bet this place is gorgeous when it's warm. <laughs> so we just got wonderful trail magic here. Look at all this food. And they have propel donuts and you are low gear low gear and side quest, side quest. low gear through right hike last like year yes ma'am so very thankful for both of you for this trail magic this is a great pick me up thank you absolutely thank you. anything for you oh thank you happy trails happy trails oh my gosh so on the way down the whole trail magic i was thinking i hope there were chili dogs and soup and would you believe it they had hot dogs and vegetable soup. I ate a bowl of soup and a hot dog. This is after I had a tortilla with chicken up at the top of the shelter, which I forgot to mention is the highest shelter on trail. So we ate lunch, first lunch at the highest shelter on trail. I don't know if I'm gonna make it today because I ate too much. <sighs> I don't know if you can see it, but down there, that's the trail magic we were just at. And it's really cool with the clouds. And we're going up. I ate too much. <laughs> it's raining again.
We've hiked over five miles today. I'm breathing much better today than yesterday, which is weird because it's been raining all day. <coughs> and when it's rainy and humid, it's hard for, and cold, it's hard for me to breathe. But, um, yeah, we're in this little, like, grove looking thing. Roan Mountain Highlands were a bust. We didn't get much of a view. I mean, I got some on camera but not as much as I would have liked. <sighs> Maytag wants to go. Oh goodness, this is really muddy. Uh, Maytag wants to go only 10 miles today. We have 16 miles. Wait, not 16. There'll be, if we go only 10, that's pretty. Uh, then there will be six miles we have to do tomorrow to get to get off where we're going to Mount Harbor Hostel and Station 19E. Um, I had wanted to go more than 10 so we can get more out of the way, but that late start we had, we didn't start until 9 o'clock. And then the trail magic, which was wonderful. <laughs> um, there is a shelter coming up in about two miles where I think we can have a snack or so. It's still raining. There's like no sign of this thing. Yeah, this is the nastiness we're hiking in, all this mud. No sign of it letting up. We're not getting any views because of the clouds. But um, I'm enjoying it today. Believe it or not, with all the crap going on today, you'd think today would not be good for me. But actually, I'm enjoying today much more than yesterday. At this point yesterday, I was dying and I wanted to quit like for the day and just tent. Of course, Maytag wasn't having it because we have to be there for our reservations tomorrow. And one of my friends is coming. I'm get to see another friend. So we'll see her. Her name's Barbara. We'll see her tomorrow. There's the famous over mountain shelter that is condemned. You're allowed to camp there. We saw from the other side, there's a whole bunch of tents there. Um, you can only camp within a certain area and there it looks like they're all in the area because I can't even see a tent right now But pretty darn cool. It's point three off trail which make it point six to go there and back and we're We're, we're gonna hike. We're on Little Hump Mountain right now And we're gonna camp on the other side of Little Hump. We got 2.2 miles until we get there There's over Mountain Shopter again I can just see the edge of tents. Ooh, that's gonna come flying off. Wow. It's beautiful. One final look at the shelter that's condemned. It's a shame. I would have loved to have gone. It's one place I wanted to see, but my hat just flew off. Something that has transpired today that in the midst of all the rain all day and the awful mud today's been let me show you my shoes look at this this is the muddiest day since we've been on trail the muddiest by far I've fallen twice today I hit a tree on my left arm then the second time I fell I hit a sharp like stump on my right arm 
So I'm sure I've got at least one bruise because both arms hurt. <laughs> ah, I'm lucky nothing else happened. But uh, what also has occurred is I noticed going down Roan Mountain that um, something was wrong with my shoe, my right shoe. And the rubber's coming off the bottom. Like, it's a miracle I haven't caught it. Like a, a small, narrow stretch of rubber. I'm sure it's going to get caught eventually. But, remember I told you my friend Barbara is coming tomorrow to meet us. Well, I called her in the rain, standing on a rock in the midst of mud and water so that I could have signal and told her, you know, like, hey, can you drive me tomorrow to an outfitter? I don't even know where one is. I I couldn't even look it up because it was raining. And uh, she asked me what size I wear, what shoe. And I told her and she found a place. She's a half hour from where she was. and. She got them. So, they only have one color. That's what I get. I'm very fortunate to get a pair of shoes right now. So, I am just one lucky person today. I'll tell you, between falling and my friend coming and getting the shoes, that uh, just very lucky. Ah, I'm, I don't even know how far I am to big bald, to tell you, or little bald. To tell you the truth, I haven't looked in a while. I don't think I've made it that far. I've probably made it a half mile since I got on last time. There's the top of Little Hump. It's a half mile away. Oh, look at the views here. Beautiful. Something I forgot to tell you also is we talked to Moss and um, Hayes and their uh, the place that we got trail magic today, <coughs> Carver's Grab, that's where they're going to be staying tonight. So then they'll be 15 miles away. Uh, and they have booked uh, a spot at the Mountain Harbor Hostel as well. And so they're going to be there tomorrow. So the gang will be all back together tomorrow, which will be nice. All right, half mile up. And another, I think, half to this uh, campsite. So I have about a mile. Little Hump Mountain. Here. Ooh, it's cold. And that must be Big Hump, which we're doing tomorrow. <sighs> We're camping in between Little Hump and Big Hump. So first thing in the morning, I'll be climbing up that puppy. It's gorgeous. 5:35. I got to get my butt to camp and get some dry, warm clothes. Today has been very hard. Not with my breathing, but it's been we've been walking in slushy snow, mud, 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 water, mud water. Oh, man. It's crazy. But I've actually enjoyed today way more than yesterday. Yesterday I was struggling. Today, I'm doing great. All right, let me get on up the trail.